What? Three of the nominees for Best Musical are right here on the same street. Hello, show ticket fans. Jason Crispin here, ultimate Broadway fan. I'm in a taxi right now because the Tony nominations just wrapped up. Uh, I was there front row. It was fantastic. I have to say hello to Jane Krakowski and um, Chris Jackson. It was phenomenal. Um, but Tony surprises. Gosh, Tony snubs. Some amazing nominations this morning. I'm sure people are waking up so excited about the nominees. Uh, I'm about to take you down in Times Square Theater District, show you the outside theaters of the four best musicals. So stick with me. Woo! Okay, so I'm in front of the Imperial Theater where they have Natasha Pierre and the Great Comet of 1812. An amazing show, long title, but amazing musical. It led this morning's nominations with 12 nominations. Oh my gosh, from production designs to costumes to, to the leads. Um, even Lucas Steele, who is a future performer in the musical, got a nominated. So excited. Um, go see the show if you haven't gotten a chance to see it. It's like one you never, never will have gone to before. It breaks the fourth wall. You're immersed into the theater. It's fantastic. So Natasha Pierre and the Great Combat of 1812. Look at the video. They're awesome. Ah! Here at the August Wilson Theater, uh, where they have Groundhog Day, the musical, got seven Tony nominations today. One of the nominations was for Best Musical. Andy Carl got a nomination, which is awesome. His third, um, especially with him getting hurt, his ACL getting um, injured in previews and whatnot. And so we're so excited. Good job, Groundhog Day, the musical. Woohoo! Okay, I'm outside Come From Away. Seven nominations, including Best Musical. Um, the show is, uh, they call it kind of a sleeper musical, which means that it was kind of a, a slow growing hit, um, but word of mouth has been huge for the show. Tons of people who have seen it. Um, I know I have friends who have seen the show and they're like, you have to go see it. Um, so I'm seeing it. Okay, everyone, I'm at the Music Box Theater now. This is where Dear Evan Hansen is. So excited, it got um, nine nominations. Um, I'm seeing the show tonight, which I'm really, really excited for. Um, all my friends and students and everyone has loved, loved, loved the show ever since it was off Broadway. Um, so glad for Benjamin Platt, who got a nomination. Um, Rachel Bay Jones in feature performance. So huge, huge hit. So excited to see it. Congrats for the nominations as well.